Fiorentina in Italia. Fiorentina is the first professional men's club in Italy to be affiliated with a women's team. And that's a very important step because, in my opinion, it's the only way to help grow this movement. Florence, a city celebrated as the birthplace of the Renaissance. Now the Tuscan capital is overseeing a new dawn in women's football. I think Fiorentina started this venture because it believes in women's football. And in my opinion, it's the exception. Because in Italy, we're still very behind. Unlike abroad, which has seen the sport develop over the years, there are still many preconceptions here. But Fiorentina had faith, and let's hope that other clubs follow its example and do the same quickly. Building on the legacy of Firenze Calcio, Fiorentina Women was founded in July 2015 and enrolled straight into Italy's top female division, Serie A. We were contacted two years ago by Fiorentina, who showed their interest. They leapt into it with great enthusiasm, which has showed in how we've developed. Initially, we had to adapt to being a professional club with all its regulations. But all the girls, along with all the staff, adapted very quickly to the situation. The first season was very positive because we had an extraordinary change take place at the club. We are part of an amateur world, but now with this club, we're breathing a new air of possibilities and professionalism. While in Europe, many top clubs run a women's team alongside the men's, in Italy, Fiorentina stand alone. A veteran of Italy's national team, Patrizia Panico, plays for Fiorentina as they pursue change. Everything in Italy is yet to be set up. There is lots of work to do, but there is also a very high margin for growth. I think that Fiorentina is somewhat of a pioneer in this sport, in the sense that, in order to be able to grow, this sport needs established structures and highly qualified staff. So the easiest and fastest road is obviously to entrust ourselves with the professional male teams. Fiorentina women play their home games across the river from their male counterparts. Just like La Viola, they too have European ambitions, having narrowly missed out on a Champions League place this year. I think that this team is only at the beginning. We all have the same ambition, which is to achieve the best. So we are working together to reach the same finish line. We all have the same goal, and we are all working towards it. We have a lot to give. We are working hard and creating a group, and above all, we are establishing a strong club, which can serve as a model for other clubs, because we did it first. Forza Fiorentina!